Carla, this is where the six young lives were taken. The wreckage is gone, but the memorial for the victims is growing. Desiree Wilde doesn't know the victims or the families, but she came here to pay her respects and show her nine-year-old son, Jaden, just how quickly loved ones can be lost. Just because my son's nine, and they're not that much older than, like, than him, and I need him to realize that this is something that can happen in the blink of an eye. Gone so quickly, and now a town joined together by tragedy. Here last night in Lloyd Minster, over 150 people came to St. Anthony's Church to remember the three teenage girls killed in the crash. Naomi Salas Schaefer, 13 years old, and Mackenzie Moen and Amy Hurley, both 14. 15-year-old Taryn Atfield, 17-year-old Christopher Tavener, and 16-year-old Jaden Betcher also died. Jaden and Chris attended this school in Marshall, Saskatchewan, just a short drive from the crash site. Today, the front entrance is covered in colorful messages and memories. The small town is deeply shaken by this loss. I don't think anybody really wants to think about what the next steps are because it's not just one or two steps. It's because we're here for those families. We're a community. We band together. Taryn Atfield's father took the steps no parent wants to take. On Sunday, he erected a cross at the site of the crash. Because I see it in the ditches where other people have family that dies. and I just wanted to put it there. I put that other pole with the six ribbons because there was six kids. RCMP said it could take months to determine how and why this crash occurred. So for now, family and friends must wait for answers as they continue to mourn. Carla?